A school in Essex that's only been open for four years has had to close because of structural irregularities. Sir Frederick Gibbard College in Harlow was due to welcome students back in two weeks' time, but the Department of Education has closed it with immediate effect, as Elodie Harper reports. It went up in just 12 weeks. Sir Frederick Gibbard College in Harlow has only been standing for two years, but now the government has ordered its immediate closure because it cannot guarantee the building's structural safety. For parents like Kerry, whose son is going into his final GCSE year, this news was a terrible blow. Gutted, um, upset. Um, it's my son's GCSE year. Um, and obviously they've done a lot for my son this school, um, a lot of one-to-one. -one. So, yeah, I'm worried for him now, um, for his education and his future. The start of school has been delayed, and as yet there is no news on where any temporary accommodation for pupils might be. BMAT Education Trust, which runs the school, says it was not involved in the commissioning, designing, construction or quality assurance of the buildings and that the Department for Education is taking full responsibility for resolving the situation. The school stresses they are committed to delivering the very best education to pupils possible. It's not just pupils' education that is being disrupted. I spoke to a couple of members of cleaning staff who work at the school. Because they're employed via an agency, they now find themselves out of work. One of them also had a child who was due to start in year seven, meaning the disruption to the family is very significant. The cleaners also told ITV News they had been concerned by large, widening cracks in the sports hall and main building. The cracks in the sports hall led to flooding, which was so severe they said it took the plaster off the wall. The school told us they had been discussing the state of the building with the Department for Education since last year, but had been assured it was safe. Ronnie is in his final GCSE year here. He spent the first two years of secondary school in porter cabins, then there was Covid and homeschooling, and now this. I find it difficult because obviously year 11 is one of your most like important years of learning because obviously you get your GCSEs that set you for life in that year. So it's quite sad to see that we don't get to stay in the building for the first part of it. The school was built by Caledonian Modular a company which was commissioned by the government. Another two schools built by the same company had to be demolished before construction was completed. Sir Frederick Gibbard was one of Britain's leading architects, responsible for building much of Harlow, as well as national infrastructure like Heathrow Airport. There is a terrible irony that the school built in his name is structurally unsound. Elodie Harper, ITV News.